Well, today we decided we're taking it easy. We're just going to win $1 million today. Yeah. <laughs> That's the plan. Normally we're shooting for five or 10, but today we're just taking it easy. Just chilling. $1 million with the winter riches ticket. It's a $10 scratcher here in California. And uh, let's get to it. Yeah, no fancy bonus section going on on this ticket. No nope. weird, crazy bonus games where you got to add things up or anything like that. Oh, it always gets me when they make you do math. That's not cool. But nope, on this one, we're just looking for a sweet match a multiplier up to 20x so uh let's see what we can find here today and of course the goal is one million dollars right Definitely. uh so this ticket has three of those top prizes still out there the game started with five of those million dollar prizes and uh, last time i checked three of them out there so two okay. of those bad boys already been hit and unfortunately it wasn't by us so and I don't know. Anybody in San Diego, babe, that you're aware of? Uh, no. <laughs> no. We always like to keep an eye out on the uh, California Lottery press releases to see if anybody in San Diego is winning those big scratcher prizes. Because right. it seems like it's pretty concentrated in uh, Los Angeles as well as the San Francisco Bay Area. Yep. So, which is lame because we're from the San Francisco Bay Area, <laughs> Bay Area and didn't scratch lotto tickets when we lived there. Right? Now, right? <laughs> right? <laughs> if we would have only known, my love, we would be millionaires, right? <laughs> but here we are in San Diego, shooting our shot, trying to win that big, big prize. And uh, yeah, we've been doing this for two years, if you're new to our channel. Pretty crazy. So first off, welcome. <laughs> and uh, second off, yeah, never do this. <laughs> Gamble responsibly, because this, as we have learned so far, has uh, been a losing effort. Right. Um, I mean, we're having fun so i guess that's a win right there right <laughs> but uh yeah definitely that spreadsheet is bleeding a little bit and uh we're hoping any day now that's gonna turn around with that big fat win but uh basically what we've learned about scratchers and their crazy odds is um if we hit that big win the hubby was talking to me about this the other day he's like the crappy thing is if you hit the big win it's amazing clearly for your bank account yep. but also for the youtube channel <laughs> but from what we've learned from scratchers it, if and when when we hit that big big win we don't want to buy any more scratchers with it <laughs> <laughs> probably just cut it off <laughs> probably just cut it off just put it in the bank and let it build interest because man what we've learned over the last two years is ouch this is tough you know, again, fun, but tough. So <laughs> so here we are with the winter riches trying to win ourselves a million dollars. Yep. And I'm a, a little sweaty straight off a of hot yoga today, which is weird <laughs> with this winter riches ticket, right? I'll cool you down. <laughs> I'm still sweating a little. Well, and today, babe, I was worried. I didn't even tell you this yet because I just got home a little while ago. But I was a little worried because there was a serious hippie chick next to me in yoga class today really yeah like i mean of course if we're going to yoga we're all hippie right like in one way or another because <laughs> otherwise we would just be going to the gym going to like 24-hour fitness or something like that but no we're all going to hot yoga so we're all hippie in our own way but oh man when this chick walked in with i mean dreadlocks probably down to her lower back I'm like, oh, okay. I'm like, just don't set your mat up next yeah. to me. Just please don't, because I, I have a feeling by the end of this hot yoga class, the aroma is going to be a lot. Um, <laughs> and I mean, this chick, beautiful, by the way. I mean, you know, lots of times you hear, you know, dreadlocks and you get a weird image. But no, I mean rocking body and her little yoga pants and her sports bra just gorgeous but then these amazing dreadlocks that went all the way down to her lower back and so i was i was like oh god don't set up next to me and then of course what does she do bam mat right next to mine <laughs> And I'm like, okay, and just, you know, because in yoga, they're telling you to like to keep breathing and breathe deep. And I'm like, oh, yeah. God, <laughs> this is going to be trouble. Um, so, yeah, so we got to the part of the class where we're all starting to sweat really good. And I got a whiff and I was pleasantly surprised. <laughs> 
Now, really? uh, now, granted, the whiff was very hippie, patchouli-esque, but it wasn't B.O. It was like very like, hey, I'm burning incense over here. So <laughs> okay. I don't know if they invented a new hippie deodorant that I'm not aware of, because honestly, I've tried to go all natural deodorant before. And by the end of the day, you just smell because none of them worked. <laughs> but I like legit wanted to go over the to the chick and be like, excuse me, um, what kind of deodorant do you wear? Because right. I was expecting you to reek horribly. <laughs> Ooh, 39. I was expecting you to reek. And uh, to my surprise, you did not. <laughs> but I felt that would be rude. I couldn't figure out uh, a way to word it for it not to be uh, weird. <laughs> Right. So, but I was impressed. So, yeah, if anybody's got some hot hippie deodorant tips out there, and if you know what she's using, because man, I thought I thought I was in for it. I was like envisioning a gas mask and the whole thing. But uh, no, pleasantly nope. surprised. Look at that. Okay, yeah. single match. Woo. Yeah, what are we in? We're in like five tickets deep or something. Yeah. yeah. So fifty dollars already scratched. And what is this sweet single match? Is it our million dollars, babe? There it is. Okay, a hippie deodorant for for everybody. <laughs> there you go. Here we go, everybody. Let's go. Let's Come go. On. Ouch. <laughs> All right, ten dollars. That's probably not even buying one stick of hippie deodorant. <laughs> right. Okay, so we got that one little win, but we bought six of them. So uh, we're got just one more. we got one more. Who knows? Back to back win. So hopefully they're gonna go ticket win million dollars so let's let's see it happen right here but yeah in that yoga class man i see all kinds of people i'm sure <laughs> the young instagram models all the way to you know the old ladies who could honestly probably kick my ass because they're in such good shape <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah i was having this one lady today i swear I don't, I don't even know how old she was she was definitely way older than me and she was trying to talk me into uh going to the harder class Oh, She's, wow. uh, I'm, like, uh, I'm not quite there yet. I'm just trying not to die by the end of this class, you know, in a 90 plus degree room after an hour. I'm like, okay, water, water. Yeah. <laughs> so, but you never know. I'm always impressed by the different things I see in that class. You never know what you're going to see. But good today, hippie chick who actually smelled good. Shocking. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> you learn something new every day. All right, here we go. One more and 21. Nope. Ah, okay, these $10 tickets weren't that great yeah. to us today. We scratched 60, we got 10 back. So, uh, you know, I guess glass half full is that's better than nothing. That's true. <laughs> so we will take it, cash it in, get tickets to scratch tomorrow, and that's when we're going to win our millions. Thanks for hanging out. Always gamble responsibly, and we'll talk to you then. Bye-bye.